Cultural Revolution Tarot. Uh, this is a tarot deck that I created, and I'm still creating, um, with Christine Aguilar. It's Christine Aguilar's idea. Um, and her concepts go into the artworks. Um, we, we create the artworks together in the sense that uh, you know, she, she gives me all the ideas and what will work best and helps me out with the colouring actually. Um, and I illustrate the, the cards. Here's what we've got so far as far as uh, illustrations for the Cultural Revolution title. There's a lot more that aren't actually printed yet. These are sample cards. We've got the Nine of Cups. We've got... Uh, this was... Uh, Six of Cups, actually. Seven of Pentacles. The Chariot. The Ace of Wands. The Hermit. The Lovers. The Eight of Cups. The Six of Swords. This is actually quite an interesting one. It's called um, Death. To do with the Famines. And this is uh, one of the mythical beings of China. Four of Swords shows um, barefoot doctors, farmers who were taught basic medical uh, medical um, knowledge to help a fellow man kind of thing. Stars, one of my favourites. Three of Cups, the Sun, the Four of Wands, the Nine of Coins, the World. Six of Wands, I like this one too. This one actually illustrated in America, uh, over in Massachusetts. Strength, here's actually the back of the cards. <laughs> These are only temporary ones, but it kind of gives you a basic idea of where we're going with this kind of card. And these are based on Mao era uh, propaganda posters. Um, that's what they're influenced by. Uh, you know, and uh, here is one of the original illustrations. This is a Knight of Wands. This is the size of the card originally I was been doing. Uh, so we have a guy with the hind legs and the tanks and stuff in the background. And shrink down to this side playing cards, <laughs> so quite a difference here. Um, but we, uh, we've been working on this for over a year now, and it's a great tarot deck. I, I really enjoy illustrating and enjoy, enjoy the interaction between the people here, you know, supporting our tarot. It's always nice to see new people appreciating my work, appreciating Christine's work, and uh, we really, uh, you know, we're thankful for all the people who can support all of us. It's a very unique deck in my opinion because I've never seen anything done like this before. And it just shows that Christine is uh, on the ball about, uh, you know, creating something kind of unique. And that's also what we're doing with uh, the Twisted Tarot Tales. It's, uh, based on the horror comics of the 60s and 70s, uh, Bronze Age um, comics, um, which include uh, type of comics like Tales from the Crypt and Black Magic and uh, House of Horrors, that type of thing. We're also doing The Splendid Man, which is based on a creepy pasta. I don't know much, too much about The Splendid Man, but uh, Christine's given me these ideas and I just follow them. So far it's working kind of good. Thank you for watching. Uh, we really appreciate your interest in our um, illustrations. We really appreciate the support and we love it when you share our work. We love it when you like it and comment because that's, that's part of the journey. I mean, that's part of why we do it. It makes me, you know, influences me to keep going and to make you know brighter and better artworks whenever I hear people actually enjoy them and like them and uh, um, makes us pride you know
makes us happy. Um, so thank you so much. Really appreciate you watching this video. We hope you have your continued support. Thanks.